This is a simplified example on how to incorporate hyperlinks. So let's say you send out this email showing team members the next holiday and you would like to include a link that explains a little bit about that holiday in the email. This is how you would do it. Go back to SSRS in the design view and we're going to insert a column on the right and we're going to name this column. In this example, we're going to name it details. And then we are going to type in text that we want to use to make the hyperlink. Now highlight the text, right click on it and click on text properties. Now the text properties box will open. Click on action on the left and then click on go to URL. You paste in the path of the file that you want to open once that hyperlink is clicked. Now I'm going to paste in the path of the entire spreadsheet including the spreadsheet extension. Now once you click OK you go back to design view and preview it. Go ahead and export it as a MHTML file. When the file opens, you'll be able to click on where it says click me and that will open up the spreadsheet that we hyperlinked to. Now of course this is just a simple example, but your sheet that you hyperlink to can contain any information. It doesn't have to be a spreadsheet, it could be a Word doc or a PDF. Now let's go back to design view. Highlight the text, right click, and click on text properties, actions. And in the URL that we are hyperlinking to, take out the name of the file. Click OK. And this time we're going to export it to Excel just as an example. Now when we do that, this time when we click on click me, instead of a spreadsheet opening, a file path opens. So you can hyperlink to a file path that will show a a list of files and not just a specific spreadsheet. Now go back to design view and highlight the text. You can make the text bold, you can underline it, you can change the font color to blue, you can do anything you would like with formatting. So go ahead and preview it and you'll see that now it actually looks like a real hyperlink with the underline and the blue. So thanks for watching. If you have any questions, leave them down below and hyperlinks are very easy. I hope you find them very easy as well.